These cracks, called lineae, are believed to have formed from the shifting and stretching of Europa's icy shell, creating fractures that can be over 200 meters deep. The forces that deform this outer layer of ice are driven by Jupiter's immense gravitational pull, as well as from its neighboring moons Io and Ganymede, which tug at Europa as they pass by in their orbits. The immense forces cause tidal flexing, similar to how our moon affects Earth's tides, but on a far grander scale. While Jupiter's powerful gravity plays a huge role in shaping these fractures, there is another side to the story, however. Scientists found that some of Europa's longest lineae did not match the predicted patterns of fractures that should be created from tidal flexing alone. They determined that the patterns would fit very well, however, if Europa's surface could move independently from its interior, as would be the case if a layer of liquid existed between the crust and the moon's rocky mantle. This suggests that Europa may experience a kind of ice tectonics. When sections of Europa's icy surface move and shift over one another, they crack and the result is new fractures. Just imagine the constant dance of freezing, cracking, and shifting beneath your feet if you were able to live on Europa's bizarre surface. <laughs>